And well, on to the latest as far as the 16th day of ongoing agitation is concerned in and around the national capital. Uh, well, attempts are being made by the centre time and again to reach out to the protesting farmers. They're saying that they're open to another round of talks. Uh, we've also been told our farmer union leaders have rejected all of those who are trying to play politics over the ongoing agitation. But they're saying that they will not relent. They will continue protesting. In fact, the coming few days, they're only likely to intensify their protest. 12th and 14th December will see protests uh, across the country. They will be blocking the uh, Delhi Jaipur Highway as well. Uh, they said that they'd given the center deadline for 10th of December, which has passed away, and hence they are only likely to intensify their protests going forward. So they remain adamant. They say that they will not settle for anything, uh, but the laws that must be repealed is what their demand is. Uh, but the very fact remains that there is an attempt, deliberate attempt that is being made day in and out to hijack these protests, which has now been turned down by the centre, by the protesting farmers as well. All of them who say that this will not be tolerated, that the protesting farmers, their agenda is only that these laws be rolled back and any kind of politics that will be played over the same will not be acceptable. Uh, Union Agriculture Minister Narendra Singh Tomar also just a short while back when he spoke to Republic Media Network said that uh, these attempts have been rejected by the farmers. In fact, in some breaking developments that we're picking up on your television screens of how the Bharat Kisan Union will be approaching the Supreme Court over farm laws. So now the matter will be taken to the top court. Farmers Union to approach Supreme Court over farm laws. Remember, they have made their intentions very clear. Their demand is just one, that these laws be repealed. Any kind of amendments... Uh, that are being pushed for by the centre is not acceptable to them. They have rejected the draft proposal that was sent by the centre. The centre, though, maintains they are still open to talks. They are open to keep in mind anything that the farmers have to suggest as far as those laws are concerned, but they will not roll back the law. So certainly we're looking at no breakthrough yet. In these talks, the centre says that the farmers must reach out to them, hold another round of talks, and certain mil middle ground can be reached. But now the Farmers Union deciding to move the Supreme Court over scrapping of the farm laws. That's the latest breaking input we're picking up on the same. This despite the centre time and again making attempts to make sure that uh, the deadlock comes to an end with the protesting farmers. But the Bharat Kisan Union now decides to move the Supreme Court over scrapping of the farm laws. Narendra Singh Tomar, Union Agriculture Minister, uh, just a short while back, though, rejected the politics being played over the ongoing farmers' agitation because certain uh, posters were held by certain protesting farmers at the Tikri border that demanded that the likes of uh, Sharjil Imam Umar Khalid be released. So certainly diversion tactics that are being used, uh, rejecting the same, that's the latest that the Union Agriculture Minister has to say. This is what किसान की मांग एमएसपी की हो सकती है किसान की मांग एपीएमसी की हो सकती है किसान की मांग एक्ट में प्रावधानों को लेकर हो सकती है लेकिन यह किसान की डिमांड कहां से हो सकती है अगर यह डिमांड और यह पोस्टरबाजी अगर वहां हो रही है तो मैं किसान यूनियन के नेताओं से कहना चाहता हूं कि इससे बचना चाहिए और यह किसान आंदोलन को बिखेरने की कार्यवाही है सर एक सवाल और क्योंकि विपक्ष आप Nalini, my colleague and our legal correspondent also joining us with the latest development. The Bharat Kisan Union, Nalini, has decided to move the Supreme Court over the farm laws. Take us through the petition details, please. Krithi, this petition has now been filed before the Supreme Court. And there is, this is one of the first few petitions that are actually coming in the top court on this particular issue that have been filed by the farmers themselves. So it's the Bharat Kisan Union that has approached the Supreme Court in this petition. Through their lawyer, A.P. Singh, they filed this asking for complete scrapping of all of these three laws, saying that they are not in the interest of either farmers or the agricultural sector of this country. So there are other petitions, PIRs, that have also been filed in the past, in the recent past, that have been challenging these laws, that are yet to come up with hearing before the Supreme Court. So it's likely that this petition will also be coming up with those uh, PIRs itself. But the reason why this is relevant is because this is the first time 
अच्छा तो किसान यूनियन हैज अप्रोच टू टॉप कोर्ट asking for these three laws to get scrapped because so far the only thing the protests happening from their side and the dialogue that was happening between the kisan union leaders along with the government minister all right crucial development indeed many thanks nalini for that